Today we're going to make homemade barbecue sauce. Here we go. First of all, you need something to put it in. Okay, here we go. One teaspoon of ground paprika. One teaspoon. One teaspoon of Worcester sauce. One fourth of a teaspoon of garlic powder. One fourth teaspoon. One fourth of a teaspoon of onion powder. One half teaspoon of barbecue powder. No, it's one half tablespoon. Sorry. One half tablespoon of barbecue. Memphis style barbecue powder. Cayenne pepper, one fourth of a teaspoon. Okay, this is the one half. Tablespoon. We'll need four of these. This is molasses. This is one half tablespoons. You need four of them to make two tablespoons. Okay, we got our molasses in there. Now we need our apple cider vinegar. We need two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar. 
two tablespoons Okay, we've got a 15 ounce can, but we only need 8 ounces of it. We only need 1 cup of it out of the 15 ounces. Need 2 tablespoons of tomato paste. Two tablespoons of tomato paste. Two tablespoons. You need brown sugar, two tablespoons of brown sugar. Two tablespoons of brown sugar. Okay, you'll need one. Teaspoon of black pepper. One teaspoon. Okay. Okay, now we're going to add about one-fourth of a teaspoon of sweet chili sauce. Heat this up until it gets thick. We're going to make barbecue chicken with this. Homemade sauce, barbecue sauce. Heat this on about five minutes and it will get all over your stove. It's all over mine.
This is like a sweet sauce to me. Like a sweet barbecue sauce. Turn it down on probably about four and it don't get all over the stove. But if you put it on high, it will. It's all of mine right now. And I just cleaned my stove. Had to clean it again now. Now you'll need one half teaspoon of yellow mustard. One half tablespoons, I mean, not teaspoons. One half tablespoon. Okay, that should be enough right now. One half tablespoon of mustard. One half te teaspoons of ketchup. One half tablespoons of ke ketchup I mean one half tablespoons okay let's go over this recipe again eight ounces of tomato sauce two tablespoons of tomato paste two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar two tablespoons of brown sugar two tablespoons of molasses one half tablespoon of mustard one tablespoon of Worcester sauce, one teaspoon, I mean, one teaspoon of Worcester sauce, one teaspoon of smoked paprika, one fourth tablespoon of garlic powder, no, teaspoon, I mean, one fourth teaspoon, one fourth teaspoon of onion powder, one fourth teaspoon of cayenne pepper, and then you put black pepper and salt to taste. Okay, here we go again. Eight ounces of tomato sauce. Two tablespoons of tomato paste. Two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar. Two tablespoons of brown sugar. Two tablespoons of molasses. One half tablespoon of mustard, one teaspoon of Worcester sauce, one teaspoon of smoked paprika, one-fourth teaspoon of garlic powder, one-fourth teaspoon of onion powder, one-fourth teaspoon of cayenne pepper, and one-half tablespoons of ketchup. Okay, let me taste it right quick. Tastes pretty good right now.
Parsley flakes. Half a teaspoon. Onion flakes. One teaspoon. Okay, now we're going to get our chicken out, put it in a crock pot, and pour this over top of it. And let it cook four to six hours. If the chicken's uh, froze, and if it, uh, if you want it uh, longer, cook on low, eight hours. And the chicken, if it's froze, will make its own juice. So you don't have to add water. Okay, I'm going to get my chicken out and start putting it in the crock pot. Okay, we sprayed our uh, crock pot with this. We got our crock pot heating up on high. Starting to put our chicken in there now. We got it frozen. These are uh, thighs and legs. We got three legs in here and three thighs in here for three people. Okay, now let's pour our barbecue sauce on it. Now this will make its own juice. Now after you get done cooking the chicken for four to six hours on high, you can take it out, either baking oven for 20 to 30 minutes to get it brown, or you can put it in your uh, air fryer for 20 minutes, 10 minutes on each side. I'm not adding no water to this. Okay, if you want to uh, set it and go, cook it on low for eight hours. I'm going to cook mine four to six hours. And then I'm going to put it in my air fryer. For 10 minutes on one side, 10 minutes on the other. If you want to bake it, though, uh, after you uh, cook it four to six hours, then put it in your oven at 350 and bake it for at least 15 minutes on one side, 15 on the other. This is our recipe for today. Please like, share, and watch all the way to the end. Where I can get credit for the video. That's a good way to support me too. Tanya Fugit slash home cooking YouTube. Thanks for watching. This is my homemade barbecue sauce and chicken for today in the crock pot. Thanks for watching.